right. Last night and yesterday. I slept all right, although I don't feel 100% this morning. I'm, I'm a solid 95%, not even that, maybe 90% this morning. Hmm. Boy, but 90% at age 60 is like better than 100%. It's like 110% at age 30. I could never have dreamed of feeling this good at age 30. What a strange thing to realize all of a sudden. My best days at age 30 were never as good as even a mediocre day in age uh, 60. Wow, the bar, the bar has been set so much higher. And not even the bar. It's not something I have to reach for anymore. It's, it's like, a, like a sea has flooded and the, my ship has risen. That's what it's like. That also explains why I'm always saying that I would never go back to a, a decade prior, even if I were to have all that time to live again, even if I could live it differently, not if I had to go back with the equipage of that time. Mm -mm. Give me whatever time remains in whoever I am now. Thank you very much. As for yesterday, let's take a look at my checklist. <clears throat> I've turned the corner in this book, so I'm going back. So it's a little hard to read sometimes. Uh, for the eighth, I completed everything that I needed to do. All that's done. And I almost on the work side, I had two items that I didn't complete on the work side. So what I do is I take those items and I move them, uh, promote them forward to today's checklist, which I've already got a good start on. I've already completed uh, three items there. Answered YouTube comments responded to all meta comments and responded to all my personal email. Yesterday was a good day. I was at the office. I did get tired driving home. I had to pull over and uh, sleep by the side of the road. Same place they seem to do it often. I just run out of steam about Edinger on the 55 and I pull over there and this time I, I parked in the on the street just outside a used car outside of a new car lot and I noticed when I woke up that the car salesmen were watching me maybe anticipating I might be a customer about to come in, although I'd been sleeping. I had, and I was out. I laid back, I set the, set the seat back, closed my eyes, and the sleep of death. And I won't say it felt good afterwards, but at least I wasn't in danger of falling asleep on the road. I thought this problem had passed, but clearly it's not. Hmm. It's not feeling like any serious thing anymore. It feels like it's just a consequence of my growing old. That's all, that's all right quiet day otherwise in the mind more and more my mind is becoming quieted giving up on free will was a big uh, point in that it's more like it's more, now it's more like riding riding not a roller coaster but riding like I always say an inner tube down a stream watching the scenery go high by nothing really ambushed me yesterday I was a little nervous in the one big meeting that I had yesterday, just one meeting that I had, and it was a big one, but I pulled it off. I'm on, I'm on my game at work now, so it's not, it's pretty hard for stuff to ambush me anymore there. I don't mean to sound self-congratulatory, I'm dealing with facts, this is part of what this is, is to deal with the world honestly, and uh, that's something to consider. 